with y'all. I'm in Thailand. Now the thing is, I don't know why I decided to book something so quick to landing, but I have approximately an hour to get to the hotel, change and stuff, and be ready to go see some elephants. So that's what we're gonna do, but I'm so excited. <laughs> show you my outfit as I said it was crunch time getting off of the plane and getting to the hotel on time but this is the look that I'm going with I made it just in time and they should be picking us up pretty soon it's gonna be some water so head to the head wrap because I'm like I want to try and make it make it fashion but also protect the hair you see what I'm saying anyway <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna go see feed elephants and shower elephants, but I do want to do a hotel tour. I think we, I should do it when they clean. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So I'm probably gonna do it like tomorrow, but I really like. I'll give you a little sneak peek of the part I'm most excited about. There's a child in there. Ignore the child. He's not a part of the shop. Um. But yeah, it's the pool. Hey. Apparently the mosquitoes are pretty bad because the jungle. Hello. <laughs> what am I supposed to say? No, um, whatever you want. Um, How are you feeling about this elephant? She's more excited than I am. <laughs> but I'm excited too. We're going to see them. We're going to test them. Yes. I get a lot of pictures. <laughs> Oh, no. <laughs> he, from Senegal. You're from Senegal? Yeah. Oh, and you're from Senegal? No, I said Nigerian. He said what part of Africa are we from? Okay, okay. Oh, Nigeria. Yeah, I don't speak French. Oh, yeah, okay. But she's not looking. Oh, c'est beau. Ah, je comprends pas. Yeah. Ah, je parle un petit peu. Wow. You could not speak French. <laughs> Tell me if they're speaking correctly. <laughs> <laughs> I know. <laughs> so it seems like this is the group of people going. Our batch. First thing that I know is going to be feeding and then showering. I'm smiling. <laughs> All I'm doing is smiling. But look at this view. The mountains in the background. Brothers and sisters in Christ, look at this view. Please. <laughs> <laughs> this is my viewers, okay? Wow. I'm very excited. Thank you very much. Okay, enjoy feeding. Enjoy feeding. Enjoy feeding. Wait, okay. Uh, you, you, can, you can feed that one? Okay. Remy. Does that one have to Remy. Yeah, I think this one does. He's the most hunger here. Hey. Oh, okay. My name is Cookie. Let's go to cookie? the other one. Cookie, hungry. cookie. Well, she doesn't have enough food. Cookie. I don't want this one that's hungry. <laughs> I do. <laughs> Why? <laughs> you want the one that's hungry? Oh, I'm Okay. Oh, Wait, let me feed it. <laughs> yeah. The moment I've been waiting for. She has. <laughs> Did you get it? Yes. Oh my god, it's hot. It's kind of. Hey. Yeah. It's in the soup. No, we to feed this elephant. We can't just feed Cookie. We have to feed all of them. Who was he? said. We have one more little one. Oh, it has a lot. It's tiny. You're so cute. You think they're humongous? 
One. Two. So, you can make rice balls to feed them for like some supp supplemental food. Michelle, I'm my favorite. Dumbo. Oh, Dumbo. Dumbo. What is this? Pumpkin. Pumpkin banana. <laughs> My hand, all race bully. I think they said this was squash, pumpkin. Not meat, because they're vegetarians, but I don't know what the rest of it, but I'm gonna wash my hands. Oh. <laughs> now it's time for the shower part. We get to basically stand under here with them. That's so pretty. You guys hungry? We're on the ride back to the hotel, but we passed this place and we're like, yeah, Akachi actually spotted it, and we're like, oh, maybe. We'll be able to get some like pad thai or some, you know, food that's cheap and cheerful. So, let's see what they have. We still don't know what this place is called, but... Yeah, it smells really good. Where? Here. Oh, I don't know. What's that? Oh, pad thai? Lembu. What's that? It doesn't say I think they're frying the meat. Okay. Oh wait, is this durian? What is it? What is? We gotta find something to eat here. Okay. The guy in the taxi is gonna wait for us while we find something, so we're gonna figure something out. Whoa! Oh. Yeah. Now we're cooking with gas. So this must be drunken noodles. This must be fat time. What is this, honey? I think that's tongue. Of some sort. Okay. Yeah, a little. A little, a little. Yeah. Thank you. How much? 20. 20 what? Baht? 20 baht. Yeah. Oh, okay, 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 gotcha. Thank you. How much is 20 baht compared? Uh, easy baht. Okay. Okay, 20. Okay. How much? Okay, great. We're gonna have another one. Yeah. How are we gonna create another one? Hey, girl. No exception. Oh, you put, she put all the stuff on it? Yeah. Okay. Hold oh, this. For us. This for now, I still want to see what's going on. Okay, so. Okay, thank you. Thank you. 140. 140. What's it say? Oh, no, that's not mine. Oh, no. Just this two. Oh, thank okay. you. Yeah, so this is 40. Okay. First of all, I never got to show them. I tried to convert some money. Okay. I didn't know how much. <laughs> really, it's fine. Thank you. This is 10? Yes. This is 10 also. Hold on, let me actually show you. I've never seen that before. Okay. You should take okay. one back as a souvenir. I... This pork? Pork? It looks like it. Wow, it's like giving Nigeria money. Except this part. I don't really, Nigeria don't really have all the fresh fish. Come on, oh. I thought these were snails, but they're not. Oh, what's this? It's a turkey. It's 
chicken. It wasn't a part of the plan, but I'm into it. Grabbing some food. You have to find some more stuff. Maybe we could get some of the fried corn in the back. Like for some meat. That side where you thought they were frying something. But hold on, hold on. Fruit, fruit, fruit. You guys know I love to try some new fruit. I don't know what this is, but it looks good. Ooh, mango. Yes. What is this? What what is it? What's this called? Huh? I don't know if I know, but I want to try this. And I want this as well. Yeah, I know. I love mango. What's this? Lychee? Is that lychee? Sorry. I love lychee. Okay, since I've had mango before, but this looks good. This looks the F good. Okay, I want all of it. <laughs> okay, hold on, hold on. Got back. Akachi's there sleeping. But I'm going to try this food that we got. This is some pad thai that costs about a dollar and 25 cents. You should tell them where I'm sleeping. Why are you sleeping? I'm jet lagged. Oh yeah, oh, I'm definitely, no. <laughs> They were in Asia. <laughs> Some chicken. I cannot remember how much I paid for this, and I don't know what these are, to be honest. I think they were like scallion pancakes or like bamboo pancakes, something along those lines. So I'm gonna try them all. Like I said, that's a catchy back there. Like a bump on a log. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna go to Pad Thai first. <laughs> this is good. This is good. And it's not even warm. Because I took a shower and everything. Alright, I'm going to try this thing now. I'm pretty sure this is the bamboo. Okay, yeah, I'm pretty sure this is the bamboo. Ooh, my rice is. Pad Thai kind of spicy. It hit me now. Um, Let's see. It has an interesting smell, that's for sure. But it's good, I think. <laughs> I don't know, the bamboo smells funny. So I don't know about that one, but this one is chives. Let's try this. Not bad. Then I got this thing. It's like a chicken skewer. Thing with I don't know what that sauce is honestly, but let's give it a go. Oh, it's cheese. Mmm, this is good. This is good. For all this food I'm eating, Lord, please protect my belly. I don't know how this is gonna go in the morning, but hope for the best, prepare for the worst. Anyway, I'm gonna call it for tonight because at first I wanted to go in the pool, but I don't think that's gonna happen after taking a shower. And also tomorrow we have Fi Fi or Fifi Island. I'm not sure how to pronounce it, but that's basically water the whole time. I cannot wait for that. So and that's 7 a.m. 7.30 a.m. that we have to get ready to go, so I might just hold off on the water for today. It was a very full day with traveling and the elephants and whatnot. Plus jet lag is kicking into some of us and me probably eventually, so <laughs> yeah. Anyway, day one down, see you at day two. Day two, we are going to Fifi or Fai Fai Island and I want to show the look. <laughs> you can see Akachi's look, oh, but this is mine. Obviously, it's a bathing suit set, but I decided to go with these shorts. I love these shorts. These shorts go with me everywhere I go. And then this cover-up for when I take things off. I love this cover-up because I use it at the top. I use it as a cover-up. I use it as a lot of things. Anyway, it is 7 a.m. And the bus, the van that we scheduled is picking us up anywhere from like 7.30 to 8.30 to drop us, which I really liked. And it was only like $5 for that shuttle service, which I think is way, way worth it if you don't want to deal with grabbing your own taxi or your own lift. So 
I will pick back up when we are there. Anything to say, Akachi? <laughs> all right, so we made it, um, and I will show you all the people. Well, you have to come on the side. Oh, okay. Akachi, we made it. <laughs> so yeah, <laughs> all the people here, and then they have some food, which is nice. There's some orange juice, some tea, and I don't know what this is, but it looks that like I like it. Like it. Like it. It's something really good. What is this? Chest, touch of moima and this. Oh, I think I know it. I think yeah, I know what you're talking about. I don't really like that one. I don't think. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they have some bread and all this stuff. So we're gonna eat something and then wait to get on the boat. So we're just getting onto the boat, the speed boats. They're gonna take us to the different spots. I don't know how many we have, but I'm very excited about it. Okay, let me pay attention. Because this is how you. You end up effing up, oh, effing around big, and finding yeah, out. Jesus Christ. Yeah, you didn't have to So beautiful. We parked a bit. <laughs> and now, I think you're getting in, right? You're gonna go to the water? Yeah. I'm gonna go in too. I just wanna, I have to use a life jacket because I don't want my hair to get way So I think I'm gonna use a life jacket right here. Grab one of these and get in there, honey. Like swimwear. Really? Where is the place called? Fifi the Blue Fifi. <laughs> anyway, we're done here. And we're gonna leave. It was fun. Oh, the sun is coming out. Yeah. Okay, we got to this place. I think he said it's Maya Bay. Maya, Maya. But we have to walk there. So we got off the boat. And now we have to walk down in order to get there. Look at this. So, this is the plan. We're gonna get down there and get some pictures. Hearing it. But yeah, I think we keep walking. And then we'll be able to get there. Let's see here. May Maya Bay. Maya. My baby's name is gonna be. Maya Ellie. Maya Ellie. Oh Lord. <laughs> Maya elephants. <laughs> I love the elephants. I'm pray, I'm pray, and I love Maya Bay. When, when she goes to school. Yeah. Maybe one would be like in name Maya. Oh, I'm gonna come back to the point. Oh yeah, that's where people Maya, get the question. Maya and Ellie. Mm -hmm. That's cute. <laughs> Leaving this island, yes. 
so beautiful. Oh my gosh. We were able to get some pictures. So I think it was a success in the suits. But yeah, it's so nice, the sand. It's a monster. And then later tonight, we're gonna try Naka night market, weekend market. So that should be fun to grab some grub. We made it to the last and final destination on this tour. I don't actually know the name of this place, but it's some sort of island. Basically, we could go to the beach again. Um, you can't really see the beach, but that's pretty much it. But we're just sitting, well, I'm sitting, I catch you sleeping like a bump on a log. Um, and yeah, because we have like an hour here to kill. So, yeah. It's been a long day, but my hair held up. Shout out to my Fulani people. Anyway, to my people, them. Maybe I'll film a little bit of the food. Because after all, that's what I came to this country for, the food, to be honest. So we're gonna go to a Naka night market. Um, it's only open on the weekends. So luckily we're here on a Friday, Saturday situation. So that means we get to have at least one day that we're here that is open. So I definitely want to go see that. And that's probably where we're gonna eat dinner and everything. Um, yeah. Anyway, I'll see you guys when we shower, change. We're back and going for that, bless you. Anyway. They, they put Akachi in charge of the music. <laughs> please listen. Please listen to the song that Akachi chose when they put gave her the um, the ox car chord. Chill, that was loud. That was loud. It was not meant to be. Yeah, I got the bathroom. Up here. Let me see. We come in here. Don't mind all our stuff, obviously. I'm dead to life. I'm great to Naka night market, food market, to grab some grub. This is the look, it's nothing particularly fancy. And I got these shoes on because they're so walkable and you can push through and say, hey, wait, 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 give me some of that squid, give me that. So, <laughs> I'm very, very interested in trying a lot of random stuff, but I also just want pad thai and some noodles and stuff. Anyway, I got these here, we are ready to go. Just got this pad thai for 80 baht, which is the equivalent of like 275, and it's a lot, and it's good. Try. What is this? I don't think so. A oh, crispy pork, garlic, oh, a lot of pork stuff. Day three in Thailand. Thai Thai. Anyway, I just came in from the pool. That's Akachi in the back. <laughs> a bump on the log. I like saying that. Uh, but yeah, I just did a swim. But yeah, the pool was really nice. And I have the mango that I bought. The mango was okay. 
I think I like Mexican mangoes. I like mangoes with a bit of a sour, re punch. Like I don't, I don't like the sweet mangoes. Yeah, so it's okay. I also brought my what's this thing called? My swim cap, and it actually really worked. Like whenever I use it in New York or Brooklyn, it doesn't really work as well. But it worked really well here, actually. Like none of my hair is wet, so that's actually perfect. <laughs> And so I will be using this in all the other places we go. I'm gonna go schedule, uh, see if I could book a massage time, and then probably rinse off a little bit. Okay, going to get the massage. The problem is I don't have any more ba, <laughs> so I have to figure out how to pick. Oh, wait, someone else might be in here. Let me see. Oh, you were, oh, you come back? Okay, okay, okay. Okay. She's in there. <laughs> I'm giving someone else a massage, which is fine. I'm actually gonna try some of the food that I have been meaning to try that I bought yesterday at the Naka Night Market. So, I'm gonna give some of that a go now. Mango sticky rice, specifically. Akachi is upstairs getting breakfast. They have free breakfast here. This mango sticky rice. All right, let's give the sticky rice a taste. A go. It's good. It's random. Like rice and but it's good and this is like after being in the fridge overnight so I can't imagine we're having it fresh this is the look we are headed to old Phuket um, to grab some food and stuff and yeah then we'll be taking a flight and headed to Malaysia right to Skidau the massage was 45 no 450 ba which I, I'll do the math and put it on the screen uh, but for 45 minutes and it was quite good I quite enjoyed it no complaints okay we made it to old Phuket Akachi say hello Hi. to the blonde it's a really nice street it has so much things in the evening it gets super full and way more crowded but we're going to find a place to change some money <laughs> And, oh, I see it. Yeah. And then get some grub. It takes some pictures mainly for Akachi. 750 something. Okay. Spotted this place when we were driving back home yesterday from Fifi Island. And so she wants to take some photos here. And it looks like she has the right idea because there's a lot of people. But yeah, this is called Old Phuket. Highly recommend coming here. They just have a lot of little shops. I'm excited to eat. <laughs> yes, perfect. Thank you. Okay, so we found some street food kind of little corner thing in Old Phuket. It just has like all these random stores or whatever. <laughs> anyway, so I ended up getting some shrimp pad thai. This is 60 baht. Oh, thank you. And you got some shrimp fried rice? Mm -hmm. Yeah, fried rice. And how much was this? 70 bucks. Like, I use chopsticks, but all the chopsticks I use are like restaurant quality, fake, basically. So these are a bit heavy duty for me. My fingers are like, whoa. Ooh. It's good. It's that good stuff, baby. Okay, 
okay we just got back in to the hotel as you can see they've already cleaned up this place because we are supposed to check out i think we were supposed to have checked out we also need to get to the airport because we're doing our next stop which is malaysia very excited but um we got to get this going so we will probably see you when we are in kuala Lumpur <laughs> or malaysia but anyway bye guys We are still in Phuket and in a different <laughs> in a different room as you can see. This one has a jacuzzi, but it smells out here, so I'm not gonna use that. Anyway, update. We're still in Phuket <laughs> because of some snafus. Please have your passports at least six months valid or something like that when you're traveling to a lot of places in Asia. Anyway, so the plan now is that we are going to A lot of places in general. A lot of places in general, apparently. But anyway, so because of this situation, we have to do an emergency passport run. So we are going from Phuket to Bangkok today, and then from Bangkok with the emergency passport into Singapore to continue. So no Malaysia, but we get to see Bangkok. So we're gonna go to the front of the hotel, see if we can get our second night that we booked here back, because now we're leaving for Bangkok. We, I do have clothes on. Oh. <laughs> we are in the Central Phuket Mall. It's called Central Phuket. So it's a mall shopping center, mm -hmm. so they have two sides. This, as you can see, is a more luxury design. We have Coach, we have Michael Kors, Kate Spade, we have like Chanel, Dior, all those ones. So this is the more expensive side, but we're, <laughs> we're taking a look around, seeing what's what, and then obviously we'll get some food yes. at some point. Yes, for sure. Yeah. Made it to the top floor of the mall. It's actually quite big, I would say. Anyway, we're still doing some exploring, seeing what we can see. At the mall, having pad thai once again, <laughs> because I was obsessed. I found a Dairy Queen, and they have Thai, I, thai tea flavored ice cream, so obviously here I am. Okay. This is the one I'm getting. This one, it has the white stuff, right? What's this? Jelly. Jelly? Yeah. Okay, I'll do this one. There you go. Um, this one has jelly. Well, that's the jelly. I'm so excited about this, guys. I don't know how to contain myself. I didn't know this. See, when I came over here, I just wanted Dairy Queen because New York barely has Dairy Queen. We had one and then they closed it down. So I was just happy to get, you know, a Reese cup, something light, you know what I'm saying? Vanilla, even. Maybe a little bit of chocolate. But <laughs> boom, they have Thai. But is this, God, wow. Wow, anyway, it's I'll show so you how it looks. <laughs> it's not God. Nobody supports my sweets habit, but the Lord is still working on me. And along the way, he blesses me with lovely treats. Who am I? Do I deserve it? It's not because of me. It's not my righteousness. I don't think it's the Lord. It's the devil. <laughs> <laughs> she, she, she didn't hear she can, her tangerine shake and has a lot to say. <laughs> this is the first thing I've got. <laughs> See you drinking her tangerine shake. <laughs> yes, calling me out of out of blizzard. Make it make sense, y'all. And here's the thing: I let her slide on a lot of things. How many times have I ever seen her eat things? I said, uh-uh, that ain't right. <laughs> oh, thank you. But I let her slide. <laughs> you <laughs> should be eating. <laughs> we don't have to talk about it. Anyway, let me show my blizzard in peace. My gina chicha. Okay. All right, here it is. Delicious. <laughs> this vlog has been all over the place, I already know. But we are, Akashi went to the restroom quickly and to get some water, but we are in Bangkok, in an airport in Bangkok waiting for our flight to go into Singapore finally.
<laughs> it has been a whirlwind, okay? We thought we were going to be stuck in um, Thailand and then have to go home from there. Sorted it out by going to the embassy this morning and getting an emergency passport, which apparently they do, same day. And so from there, we are able to continue the Singapore leg of the trip. So that's what we're doing now. We're gonna be flying in just in time for all our bookings and everything with the hotel. So it's not like we lost any money when it comes to that. Uh, but oh my God, God, God has come through because we have really been flying by the seat of our pants, like booking flights same day. Booked the flight from Phuket to Bangkok and flew that day that we booked it. Boom. Booked a hotel that day in Bangkok just to stay the night, spent the night, was out of there. We were out of there by six o'clock. Once we've got the emergency passport in hand, booked the flight that exact moment to come to Singapore and this today and now we're taking that flight. So it has been, <laughs> woo! Jesus has come through and thank you, thank you, thank you so much. So anyway, I don't know if this vlog will make much sense with the way things are going, but I'm glad that I'm able to capture some of the endeavors. Obviously, when we're in the thick of it and trying to figure out our lives, <laughs> the camera wasn't what I pulled out first, but this is a bit of an update, and so I will see you lot, yeah, in Singapore, yeah. We made it to Singapore, <laughs> finally, and this is our room. All right. Mirror, closet, come in, got the double bed set up, we come into the tree. all right the next day in the hotel so this is actually it in the daytime so i'm pretty sure that pool is the pool for the hotel so i'm just gonna do some exploring and see last night i decided to go to the gym in the hotel so that was on floor what floor is that floor six which we have to pass to anyway to be able to see the pool so i'll probably show you guys that but yeah let's explore he's waiting for the lift So this is the gym that I went to yesterday. Let's get in there. Nice, as you can see. Pretty stacked, I'd say, for a hotel gym. Nothing crazy, but good enough. Got some treadmill time in, and then was able to work with weights and the ball in the back. I love how they have so much trees and everything here. It's it's vibesy. It's actually kind of deep. <laughs> so let's get to the pool, honey. We get here. See this on both sides. Cute. I don't think anyone goes in those, though. Something tells me. And then we get to the pool. I am definitely going to be using this. This is so pretty. So today we're going to go to Marina Sand Hotel. It's the famous hotel that you saw in Crazy Rich Asians where they have this huge infinity pool with the view of Singapore that is crazy. So we're gonna try and see that view. We shall see, because the pool is for hotel guests only. So again, we're gonna see. And then we are going to see Park Sky, the Sky Park, which also gives us a nice view of the city. 
and then we're going to try to see the flower dome which is some sort of an exhibit kind of situation that they have here and it should be really nice so i'll take you guys along with that also they have a dish here called chili crab that i really 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 want to try um it's a like famous singaporean dish to try when you're here so i'm gonna give that a go and attempt to have some chili crab um yeah it's gonna be good hello <laughs> We are finally going to head out to the first stop, which is going to be Marina Sands Infinity Pool. We shall see. Marina Sands Hotel. But anyway, I wanted to show you guys what I'm wearing. The lighting, we couldn't get to work in this corner. But yes, this dress, which I got from Shein ages ago. And I'm finally getting to wear it. I felt like it gave Thailand vibes. And I like it because these embroider detail i feel like it was very tropical anyway we're gonna head out we are in marina bay sands hotel so this is the one that has that infinity pool at the top but you could get into the hotel in general because they have like a restaurant in the back you see um yeah it's really nice this place is huge and fancy very very fancy um Look how high it goes. I guess that makes sense. Yeah. That's why we get the views. About to see the flower dome. Thank you. Thank you. Oh wow. This is cool. I'm gonna like it. Yes. It feels so cool in here. The weather. This is cool. Me too. What the temperature is perfect. Look at this. Wow. And I see that's why they call it a dome. Because the top, I guess, is like dome shaped. I see a lot more green than I see flowers. <laughs> so I'm hoping there's some color in it. Some point. But yeah. So far, so good. And at this place, I think they call it Marina Bay, Marina Garden. Something. Anyway, they have five different things that you could do. We just chose the flower garden or the flower dome, but if flowers aren't your thing, like they have a bunch of other options um, that are equally as cool. But yeah, we're checking out this one today. Okay. It seems like they have different gardens from different places, so they imported flowers. I think you said right? They imported flowers from different countries. So this one's South African, but then this one over here says Australian garden. So that's pretty cool, I would say. They tried to make it authentic. <laughs> I don't know what that is. Um, but yeah. They tried, Sha. The little statues and then in between <laughs> the masks. You right? Did you see? They tried to give us African vibes with the masked people and the um, giraffe. We're gonna attempt to get some photos. <laughs> it's actually not bad. <laughs> but it is now raining and you're taking cover, taking shelter under the bridge um, until it stops raining. But there's a whole bunch of other people. Singapore weather is kind of raining. I did some research. It's one of the cheapest places that you can get chili crab, which is like a Singaporean delicacy kind of thing. Um, anyway, it's here. <laughs> and it's a lot. Uh, this is my hand, just so you can see what I'm what I'm saying to you. Um, anyway, and then it comes with these fried montu, montu, which I don't know what 
those are really, but I know when I did my research, that's what people like it with. So we'll see. Okay, this is, it's a very messy dish. Um, I didn't even finish all of it, but look at it. And I got the, I don't even, I can't even see, it. but on my shirt, so. I highly recommend if you are in the country to give it a go. Now I want something sweet. <laughs> I want some dessert. So we're going somewhere after. We're going to the food court, basically. Which one? The hawkers or the one near? We're going to the one for okay. So we're going to some hang hangar something. There's a food court. And that'll be the first time we're going to a food court in Singapore because we haven't done that here. Um, so I'm sure I'll be able to find some cheap and cheerful things. Thank you. Uh, I'm excited to do that. This has been a day. It hasn't been a long day, but it feels like a long day. And I feel like I need to shower. I feel, I feel a lot of things. Anyway, all right. Check in later. You want to say hello? Oh, it's not even. Okay. All right. My camera's kind of broken, but this is the look. You can see Akachi's look in the background. We are headed to Sky Park Observatory because yesterday there was weather issues. There was like um, thunder star storms. So obviously that's a hazard if you're all the way up there and there's lightning striking. So we're gonna go back today. They said that you could come as long as you have your confirmation that you came, tried to come yesterday, and you have obviously your tickets from the day you're supposed to go. So we're going to attempt that. Then we're going to attempt going to a food, a hawker's center, which is where you just get cheap Singaporean, actually cheap dishes from all over. It seems like, but it's just more affordable because Singaporeans tend to eat there because the prices are good. So we're gonna go there for a bit, and um, yeah, we'll keep you posted. So we're on live. Where are you going? Like, the line is crazy, um, but it's moving pretty fast. So we will be in the Sky Park Observatory pretty soon. All right. Yeah. 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 It's raining a little bit, so we're gonna pause for the pause. But the view is nice, kind of cloudy, but it's a nice skyline. Singa, which we saw. Yeah. The rain discombobulated me, but once we're inside, I think I'll get my bearings. Because right now, yeah. Hello, hi. You like the dress? I think that's what's gonna. All right, we're back. We are back. Wow. We're finished with the Sky Park and now we're at Maxwell Food Center which is located in Chinatown. Maybe we'll be, we'll be able to go around and see Chinatown but right now we're here for the grub. Highly recommend coming to this place for cheaper food. We haven't eaten any so we don't know if it's good but we heard the prices are right. Oh wow. A lot of stalls. They have Thai cuisine. Oh, nice. Okay, Thai food. In case you didn't get enough <laughs> in Thailand. We decided to walk home. Okay, I'm trying to get these. And this, I've never been to Miami, but I don't know. This is giving me little Miami. <laughs> or little Cuba vibes. But yeah, we get to walk in the street and they have a lot of stores. This is the first time we're really walking here, so I like it because then you get to explore a bit of the things. Got all the grub from Maxwell. And what we've tasted so far, pretty good. You do have to pay like 20 cents for takeaway stuff. So if you could eat there, obviously, but we have to go. Um, but yeah, highly recommend the Maxwell. It's really nice. 
and staying in this area near near enough um, Koreatown. I feel like you can walk. You can walk a lot here if your hotel is close and get like good food for cheap without having to get a car every time or a grab every time. So recommend, recommend. Anyway. How far are we now? Three minutes. Oh three minutes, not bad. It is, in fact, somewhat drizzling, but <laughs> one thing about it, <laughs> I'm gonna be in somebody's pool, okay? You understand what I'm saying to you? I'm gonna be in somebody's pool. And this pool is absolutely beautiful, so I decided to come down and be in the water for a bit. I have my bag and everything over there, and I have my swim cap, which I'm gonna put on now so I can actually, because I'm not getting my hair wet. Okay. <laughs> okay. have dinner, dinner reservations at a place called Vu. It's kind of fancy, but we also just wanted to dress up too. <laughs> so here we are. <laughs> we got the yellow and, and we the got red. The red. <laughs> okay, and we're gonna go downstairs and get some photos, obviously. Yes. And I'm gonna we're gonna take you along to the restaurant and probably show just a little bit because they have a policy against like cameras and all that kind of stuff, but mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, so let's come into here, show our makeup. There's the makeup looks. Look at us. The red and the red. You see, blue. you see. Obviously, I'm not gonna wear yellow lips because that would be strange. So we're going with nude. But um, okay. Let's head down. Skedazzle. Skedazzle. I keep saying skedazzle. I tell her it's skedazzle. With jerk spice, cauliflower with jerk spice. We have a bluefin tartar, which is so pretty. And then we have some truffle parmesan fries. This view is insane. Say hi. <laughs> Hold on, let me start this vlog. Please, yo. Please, no copyright. No copyright. Anyway, these are looks for today. What we have on the agenda, we're going to see New Creation Church. It's yes. apparently a big Christian church here with a pastor that's kind of world famous. I look at his YouTube, he has like a million followers. Wow. It's called Joseph Prince. And so we're going to see that, and then we're going to get some food. And this is our last day in Singapore, so then we're going to oh, head to. You should tell them how you the found airport. the guy. It was very serendipitous. What? Yeah. Who? <laughs> Joseph's Prince. Someone randomly. Oh yeah, him. someone sent it in the group chat of our our church and or our church group chat. Um, and I saw it like two days ago, but I didn't really think much of it. And then I f re realized that that was the church, and the church is here, and the church Singapore. is so beautiful in Singapore. So we we're like, let's what? just go see. Maybe we'll be able to get in, maybe not, but at least we'll be able to see the outside. His architecture here is really cool. Yeah. So yeah, and I listened to one of his messages, and he's known for like breaking things down. And in that 15-minute message, he broke down like three words: lachem, like meaning bread, a different Hebrew word, another Hebrew word. So he's he gets to the meat in each little paragraph that he does um, translating it. So that's pretty cool. So basically, Asia is Jackie Hill Perry. Yes. <laughs> a different Jackie in Asia, not the Chan, but you know. That's funny. We tried to find the church. Apparently, the church is a part of this way larger building. So we found the floor that they use the church, but they use it during the week for other events and things like that. So there's a whole bunch of stuff going on up there. So we couldn't see the church. But as we're looking around this place, which I don't know where we are, but it's somewhere in Marina Bay Sands, they have this 
It's real water, a boat that you can actually sit in, and we just saw some passengers go under there. I don't know where it goes after that, but that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. We are back wow. at the Sky Park, and it is sunny. Yeah. <laughs> and so now we feel like we have actually used our ticket, not in vain. <laughs> Back at Maxwell's. I got you here. Last food before we head out. 